someone else? Teresa, I mean, I is that it? No, no, no. You love me, right? I love you. Yes, I love you. Only you. Then what is it that you have to confess? Well, I have to confess that... Well, I've always been thinking about how can I love a woman so unconditionally? I mean, you can't be perfect. There's got to be something wrong with you. So I decided to do a thorough analysis. Oh? Uh -huh. Mm-hmm. From head to toe, front to back, all around. And I couldn't come up with anything I didn't love. Not even a freckle on your nose. No, I, I love your toes, your eyes. Kneecaps. My kneecaps. <laughs> Your kneecaps. <laughs> sheer perfection. Your eyebrows. Your lips. The way you smile. Wait. Wait. I'm not finished yet. That was just the physical side, the exterior. So then I asked myself, I started, I started thinking, what makes you my Teresa? Well, it's, it's your heart and mind, your loving, caring, sweet nature, and your honesty. You know, you're everything to me. You, you are all that I ever wanted. You and my dream come true. How may I kiss you? May. Towards the things that I'm feeling. Mm. So many beautiful, wonderful sensations. Teresa, I will always be open and honest with you. I will never betray your love. Mm. <sighs> Did you say that you are going to sleep with Ethan after you tell him? that you knew he was a Bennett so that he'll stay with you? Mama, well, this is the only way. If Ethan sleeps with me, he will never leave me. You... You can tell Ethan the truth, but I forbid you to sleep with him. Do you hear me, Teresa? I forbid it! This isn't right. Did I do something wrong? No, no. Tell me, because I, I want to do what you want. You, you didn't do anything wrong. You're perfect. When two people love each other the way we do, they can't do anything wrong. Well, then, why did you just pull away? Because I... I foolishly didn't think of something. I, 
I, I, I didn't think we'd get this far. I, I didn't want to be presumptuous. I, I, don't, I, don't, I don't understand. What? Protection. I don't have any. The way things are, with I don't have a job, we don't have any money, I don't have any money. I think the last thing we want right now is a baby. So, so I, I guess I can go get some condoms. Yeah, I mean, maybe you're right. We have to act responsibly. Stay right here. Be right back. Okay. I can't wait till we make love, Ethan. There's so much I want to tell you. Did you forget something? and I do is none of your business. I imagine it's been a while since Ethan slept with a virgin. You are still a virgin, aren't you, Teresa? You and Ethan haven't made love yet, have you? And what's it to you? You and Ethan had sex when you mistakenly thought that you were gonna marry him. <laughs> yeah, it was never about marriage. Ethan and I slept together for the pure joy and pleasure of it. And that's why what Ethan and I have is so different. He loves me, truly loves me, and nobody else. Dream on. And I love him. And we're gonna get married, we're gonna have family, grow old together, and love each other every day for the rest of our lives. A word of advice to you. Don't count your chickens. You are a long, long way from the altar. 